Hey, this is Chris with vidsociety.com and in this video I'm going to do a review for you on a product called PPC Shortcut. Now I'm in the members area right now which I'm going to go over and I'm also going to show you a demo of how to use the software that they recommend in here to set up these uh, accounts within your Google Ads but it can also be used for Bing Ads. So below this video I'll put a link that will take you to my website where you can get more details about the upsells, the pricing and even some bonuses if you buy it through my website. So PPC Shortcut is a collection of done-for-you winning pay-per-click campaigns that are ready for you to upload to your Google and your Bing Ads accounts. Basically what they've done is they've already selected top performing products from places like ClickBank, GVZoo, and Warrior Plus. They've went out and done all the keyword research. They've created all the ads. They've put everything together for you. So all you have to do is upload a CSV file and you can have hundreds of ads running, thousands of keywords running in just a matter of a few minutes within your ads account. So here we are inside the members area. There's not a whole lot of training for this. Most of the stuff you see here um, is not actually video training. So uh, the first module here does go over mindset and a little bit about the course. Uh, this module goes over using the Google Ads Editor PC, how to download it, and the editor instructions. So how you're going to use the Google Ads Editor, which I have right here downloaded and set up. And then after that, what you do is you come down here to the PPC shortcut, and these are what you get in the front end pricing of, I believe, $13, which is really cheap considering that you get 15 of these campaigns completely done for you, ready to promote these products. So what you would do, for example, is come down to one of these products and you would click on it. And the video here basically just shows you how to import the file again to the Google Ads Editor. And what you would do is click the green button. And for Google Ads, you would need to download the CSV file. And then that's what we're going to upload to the Google Ads Editor, which I'm going to show you here in a minute. Now what I've done is uh, with one of the upsells, you get 30 more campaigns from like ClickBank, JVZoo, and Warrior Plus. And so what I've done under the ClickBank campaigns is I've chosen to do the one on Speechello. What I've done is I came here, clicked the green button, I downloaded the CSV file, and so what I want to do now is go to my Google Ads Editor, come up here and go under Account, Import, and choose the file that I just downloaded. Okay, it's showing us here that in this file there's one campaign, there's 39 ad groups, 117 keywords, and so what we're going to do is go ahead and click Finish and Review Changes. And what we've done is we've imported all this into here. You can just ignore all these um, error messages and everything right here. It's, it's not to worry about right now. And also all this training that I'm showing you now is also available in the members area. So that comes with the front end as well. And so what you're going to do is you want to make sure your campaign is selected up here. And then down below, you can actually dig into the campaign. So if we click on campaign, it's going to show us here our campaign, which we can come over here. We can change the daily budget if we want to, which I normally start off around $10 a day. You can start off at $5 a day if you want to. And then you can come down here. And some of the other things you may want to change is like the location. So what you do is just scroll through here. You'd find the location area um, and change it to whatever you want to. You could change the um, language to English if you wanted to. So for example, right now, this one is already targeting uh, United States, but for the language targeting, I may want to go in here and let me choose just English and click OK. And it closed on me for some reason. Let me open it back up. Okay, I'm not sure why it closed, but uh, once you do that, you can come down here, you can click on Add Groups, and it shows you all the ad groups. It shows you the default max uh, cost per click, which you can change over here if you want, your keywords and your targeting. And then under that, if we scroll down uh, underneath of ads, you're going to see where it says expanded text ads. And this is where you're going to come in and you're going to select all these uh, text ads. So we're going to click on one of these, hit control A to, to select all of them. And then you want to come over here and put your URL right here for your landing page. So if you do pay per click, you already know the best option is just to drive traffic to your own landing page, whether it's a review page, something that you set up. Because if you drive it straight to an affiliate offer, your ads are not going to get approved for it. So what you want to do is create like a, a review page. Uh, I use my vidsociety.com website for most of my campaigns that I run on pay-per-click. 
and what I'll do is I will put a video on there I will put the description of the product the upsells and as you guys can see if you click on the link under this video because that's the way that I create my sites is that you're also going to see where I have bonuses on that page and so when people visit my site from a Google ad and they see they can also get bonuses uh, the conversions really really go up with your sales and so what I'm going to do is go ahead and grab my link for my website and put in here and basically this is ready to go now that that's all I have to do and so what I want to do is come up here and click on keep and then once that's done I can come over here and click on post and it's going to automatically uh, take this entire campaign the ad groups and keywords and everything and it's going to upload it to my Google Ads account so we're going to go ahead and let it do that then we're going to jump into my Google Ads account so you can see what it looks like in there and that's it we're going to click close and let's go to my account okay so if we jump back here go to my campaigns this is my page right now the only thing I have available um, showing is all enabled so we're going to refresh and now we can see a campaign here for speech yellow and uh, we're running it for ten dollars a day now down here you can ignore all these these are just what I've been running over the past 14 days of other campaigns It has nothing to do with this one but if I go into this account here you're gonna see all the ad groups that it's automatically set up for us they created specific ads for specific keywords which is going to get you your cheapest cost per click uh, it's going to be the most relevant way of getting more clicks and a cheaper price so if I go in here if I click on one of these you're going to see that these are the three keywords that is chosen um, ignore these here you don't have to pay attention to these right now basically you want to let your ads run for about a week so you can come in here and see what's really going on and what the price is really going to be and then from there you can either choose to increase your bid decrease your bid pause ads depending on whether they work uh, good or whether they don't if we go over here and click on ads and extensions and ads you're going to see all the ads uh, that it created for you and so for this one particular keyword it created all these ads which we can go in and we can look at now if we go back to campaigns and click on ads you're going to see every ad that was created for the entire campaign so there are a lot of them and all of this is done for you a total of 234 and basically what we're going to do is just let this um, go for about an hour or two until they get approved then it's going to be running automatically and you can see here in the ad how how it goes directly to my site based upon the link that we changed uh, we can go in here and we can edit it if we want to and you can see how it put my link here it's got the headline it's got the display path it's got the description it has everything ready so you don't have to do anything else and and here we have a total of six just for this one keyword which is really good because it's going to be split testing each of these ads and you can find out which one is going to work the best so you can pause the others or you can increase or decrease your price whatever it is you want to do so if you use pay-per-click ads you guys already know how this works if you don't use pay-per-click ads they do have I think in one of the upsells a master class which goes over a lot of how to use pay-per-click advertising how to get your campaign set up uh, you can also look up some YouTube videos uh, basically getting a campaign set up is pretty easy to do on your own but there is a lot of manual work and going out and finding the keywords creating your ads uh, especially if you got hundreds of them like this is created for you uh, for specifically for these products so uh, this is a great deal really for just 13 bucks um, it's definitely something that I'm going to be using because I already promote a lot of these products anyways and this is just a way for me to get a lot of extra traffic sales and leads and so I do recommend that you check out the link below this video because you're going to learn about the upsells which I do recommend OTO number two which is going to give you 30 extra campaigns from Clickbank JVZoo and warrior plus and then some of the options you also may be interested in uh, if not don't worry about it they're not required to run uh, the Google Ads editor and to get access to all of these products here which you can start running right away with Google Ads so this is my review of PPC shortcut. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please like my video, subscribe to my channel, and if you've got questions, leave them below and I will get back with you as soon as I can. Thanks.